Okay, so after heater installation, let's go over the control switch panel. We can set a time, it's a 24 hour. This is timer. If you want to lock, create a password. Well, we don't care for that. Okay. So apparently you control not with temperature, but with the amount of the fuel, they call it oil. I don't know, maybe some people, maybe you can use oil, but in that case we use using diesel in this truck. Okay, so this is lowest, 1.6, and the highest I believe it's 5.5. So, but before, what we can do, get the fuel in the system, press down and then press OK. See, it's off, but well, let's turn it on. And in a couple seconds we will hear pump. Okay, now we can hear a pump. Okay, so that's good enough. Okay, off. So we have plenty of fuel in the system. Okay, so let's turn this puppy on. Pump is pumping. Propeller is um, spinning. And the coil, it's burning. Overheating sensor, it's not blinking, so it's all good. We are just waiting for that indication here that the fuel is in the system. Battery status. I think it's for remote control. It's slightly detonating. I think because we pump a little too much fuel. So it's gonna burn a little bit. Hopefully the heater not gonna explode. Okay, so let's crank it up. Yeah, so you control only with the amount of fuel, which is okay with me. It looks a little complicated, but uh, I I wish this display could you could turn it off, but you can't apparently. I'm gonna make a switch to shut down the whole system. So first of all, it's not gonna drain my battery. Second, I don't want you know if the truck gonna be sitting for a couple weeks. I don't want this display to lose a lifetime. So this is my heater under the seat. It's twice bigger than what I used to have. The little, the, not the Basta, but Aspire, Airtronic. This one is a big boy. Came from Hong Kong. So far I'm pretty impressed. Oh, nice and hot. Goodness. This is my toolbox. This little thing in the well probe. So if I close this section, the air blows only from here. I would do that just in case if I have a like a third skid or a pallet over here. Alright, so it works fine. 